Hello everybody, Jason905 here and welcome back to my let's play of Dark Souls 2. Now in this episode we will, well, I've had a discussion with my friend Tyler, talking about how I've got up to King Vendrick now, he does say I'm near the end of the game. So I know a little bit more about the game now and uh, King Vendrick is actually an optional boss. However, we will still be doing him for the sake of fully completing the Let's Play. We ain't going to be skipping on any bosses. We'll do all the bosses we can. I wonder what that area is there. Must be some secret I missed out on. But yes. As you know, Vendrick is in this undead ditch area here. He got pa we got past the Royal Aegis guy and um, tried to fight Vendrick. However, we got our ass kicked by him very quickly actually. Well, it turns out you can make him weaker by gaining these giant souls. We actually got one of them already in the Black Gulch. Um, they'll be in the souls area. So, this soul of a giant we have, if we can find it. Uh, where is it? Theme of song, let's try and find it. Hmm. Does it look different to the other souls? Oh, it must be this. Soul of a giant. A soul possessed by a giant. The soul of a giant who came to conquer Drangleric. Drangleic. I can never say it right. Will the giant's resentment for the king be pacified in death or only emboldened? Can be used to acquire souls. Only. However, they also weaken Vendrick. They lower his defense and you can actually kill him quicker. So his attacks... You can kill him quickly before his attacks end up killing you. Because he hurts a lot. So that will be our quest now. We now have this King's Ring. As you know, we picked up before... Well, we picked up before we started fighting Vendrick. And now we have access to all the King's Gates. So we want to go in there and wear this ring just to gain access. And this is where we should find the Giants in order to kill Vendrick. So we're going to be doing that now. Now before we go there and do that, I just want to go over a couple of things. Firstly, we have a new miracle. I actually have a clip of where we found this miracle. It's in the Shrine of Amana and it was somewhere I missed. Behind the ogre, there is a path you can go down using a torch to assist you and see where you're going. And down the end of there is the miracle Sunlight Blade. Now, as you can see, we have Sunlight Blade, but we actually have two castings of it. As well as two castings of Great Lightning Spears. That's because, also outside the episode, I visited Strayed and he now sells a second casting, well he sells a casting of Great Lightning Spear, so now we can have two. And he sold a casting of Sunlight Blade, it only has one use though, so, you know, we've got to use it wisely. It's probably our boss killing miracle, really, if we're going to be using that. So, we can get rid of that, and plonk a Sunlight Blade there, so we can have two buffs to the boss, if we're going up against the boss. Then we've got two lots of lightning spears, two lots of great lightning spears, great magic barrier, and sunlight blade. So that seems like a good setup to go with for now. Besides that, I don't think there's anything else. I do need to go and explore that grave area, because we went in that big room with all the nasty ghosts and undead in it. But we kind of just went to the left and straight down to open up that shortcut. I'm not sure if there's any extra loot in there, however, we'll find it. We'll find out at a later date. I'll, I'll take a trip there sometime. But for now, let's go and go to the... Uh, I believe Tyler said to start off with Shaded Woods Ruined Fork Road. This is the one we want to start off with, as the others will be... I think the others are supposedly useless at the moment. But this way should lead to some new areas. I wouldn't say this is a blind let's play anymore, to be honest. However, it is sort of blind to the areas. Like, I'm unfamiliar with the areas, and I've been to the areas before. But I'm not going to get lost and have a lack of direction. Which is probably best for everyone, really, you know. If I don't know why I'm going, it'd be pretty boring just to see me looking around. And just wasting my time looking around trying to figure this out. I got the King's Ring now anyway, so I knew that these doors would be able to be opened. But apparently this is the one you should go through first. So let's go through this one. Take off our Ring of Blades to put the King's Ring on. And open up for us. Haha. -ha. Let's just put the Ring of Blades back on now. I 
Ah yes, one more thing I forgot to mention. We have our Dragon Shine plus five. Whilst I was going through Shrine of Oman, I found some more Twinkle and Titan, I killing them guys. So we got a plus five chime now, which is the maximum upgrade. And it looks like we are in a new area. Ada's Keep. Hmm. What could be lurking around in this forest? That's locking us in, thank you. Petrified Dragon Bones, sweet. And what are those things? They look messed up. Come at me. Oh, they petrify. Oh, they're nasty. They don't like me. Is a swing going to work on them? Alright, oh, let's just handle these one at a time. And the petrify is building up on them, so let's be careful about that. We've got no quick cure for petrify. It does go over time. Luring skull. I hate how they just put luring skulls everywhere because it's just kind of, you know, it's a troll. Like, we know we're going to pick this up. Just why we're just going to put a luring skull there instead. Monster head, therefore trap. Read message, monster head. Attack! Haha. <laughs> Sunset staff, dark mask. Oh, is that the last part of the dark set? Oh, we've got our dark mask now to complete the set. Sadness. And then tears. Bonfire. Let's light you first. What do you have to say? Who are you? Oh. Ah, oh, it's Lucetiel. No. How goes your journey? It's alright. Not what you seek in this faraway land. But I pray for She's took her mask off. Please take these. Lucy set. Achievement unlock, Lucy Teal. Okay then, you give me your set. This, thanks. My name is Lu I beg of you remember my name, for I may not myself. Alright, Lucy Teal. My name is Lu I beg of you rem for I may Thanks a lot, Lucy Teal. I hope you remain sane, you've been a great help. I don't know what else to say, really. Treasure. I can say that. I do appreciate treasure. There's a lot of fire seeds, isn't there? At least you get much more than you need. So if you do miss any, you're probably still going to get maxed out. On one glove, at least. I mean, we could use pyromancies and they'd be pretty effective, but... I know, lightning spears just seem to do the trick. Whereas, you know... Maybe it's more of a PvP thing, where you're like... I don't just have lightning though, I also have fire as a backup plan. But in PvE it just seems kind of pointless to go for pyromancies when you have all this faith and you can use miracles. There can be miracles. Oh, it's one of them shaking carts, so they got doggies inside. Oh. Elastial of Mira. It's like loose teal. Come at me. I wonder what Lucy will have to say about this if we um, murder this guy. Let's kick this guy's ass. Ow. I'm going to drink up. Haha. -ha. You can't do that. Or well, maybe you can, it's just you didn't. Can we leave now and talk to Lucy Teal? I want to see what she has to say about the situation. What's your opinion, Lucetiel? I murdered your brother, if it was him. Or your comrade. You, you're both from Mirar. My name is I beg for him. Okay, you have no comment. Or is Ada's keep where the Mirar knights live? Well, I'll remember you, Lucetiel, don't worry. Let's summon somebody. Hecate. You'll be our friend, Hecate. Doggies. Regret, but recklessness. Visions of frost, butthole. Hello there. Hello there. <laughs> what the hell is that shit? Let's see this.
Yeah, that's too loud. <laughs> Why can't anyone have a decent voice chat? Also, what just happened? Oh, he's using the hand axe. It's an interesting choice. I have no idea where to go right now. We have multiple options. Let's explore the second floor. It's Mirror Nights. Is he attacking us? Okay, he is. There we go. There's all these guys want to break out. Ah, fuck it. Let's just grab it. Northern Ritual Band plus two. Cool. Get axed. And yes, two down. They want to break free from their mirror trap. Okay, let's... Okay, there's another guy here, okay. It's another... Spearman. And he's down. Okay, that was pointless. I guess. Uh, what's down this hallway? It's a chest. Liar ahead. Let's punch it. Guess it's fine. Great magic barrier. Oh, another casting, yay. Now we have two castings of it. Two is better than one. Right, let's see what's on the old second floor. Let's use a fragrant branch. You on this body? Yeah, we can throw lightning spears at you. <laughs> we ain't gonna fight you through melee. Let's not waste all our castings. Hey ho, chap. Dragon Acolyte Mask. Okay. I wonder if this is a shortcut. That we got rid of him. Weakness, poison, ranged battle. I could use the Sunlight Spears, but it would take up two slots. We need to get some more slots. Oh, that's an overkill on lightning spheres. Hooray for miracles. Crimson water. Uh, what do we do up here? Besides that. More hallways. I approve. Another chest. Chest ahead. These hallways are way too long for their own good. Well, right, what's in this chest? On fire aesthetics. Let's go. Is there anything down here? I feel like bad for wasting my phantom's time. What's over here? What's 
down these stairs. Well, that was a waste of time. I'm a coming. I guess that's the way to get up to the top floor, though, without fighting the ogre. Let's go. I'm interested to know what's on that bottom floor if you miss anything. Money bags. Is it going to rain gold? Oh, it's going to open the door. Okay, then. That's boring. It's a trap. These pots are a trap too. Oh. Phantom. Dark spirit. Yeah, I ain't an honor man. Bring it. Yeah, he's dead. I ain't gonna like taunt him or anything. He got 2v1, but he's the invader, so. No holds bar. Invaders do not get a second chance. Alright. What's in this door? Attacking required ahead. Barrel Slockstone, lovely. Anything else useful? Well, oh, I guess we're going down. Secret door! Why is there bonfires always hidden inside walls? Unless you know about this, this is kind of brutal. In terms of leniency to this. I hate these guys. I didn't like lightning, I did I? His lightning hurts more than mine. 797 638. How much faith does he have? Well, that was a waste of lightning spears. Okay, what does this do? Right, it's grades equipment, okay. Uh, is it worth going in? Surely all equipment would break if we stood in there too long. Let's just um, put on the ring of degrade your stuff less quickly. Bracing knuckle ring plus two. All right, fuck it. Out the key. I'm not sure how much corrosion this is actually doing. Soul guys are petrified dragon bone. And we're fine. How's our equipment doing? The rings get quite fucked up, so it's a good thing we're using repair powder there. Alright, let's put on the Ring of Blades plus one again. So it's messing up our ring, it's just not much else. What's inside this door? Oh, we have to use the key on it. It's a man! And backstab you. He'll do all that. How do I grab his loot? Soul of Proud Knight. Oh, that's a big one of those things again. Dragon Acolyte boots. That's dead. Woman will cry the head. I don't get it. 
Alright, large soul brave warrior, and we're heading through here now, I guess. Got plenty of heals left. That's a binding bolt. And that's explosion. Is it those guys? Where are we going? Did we just blow up something? What on earth? There's loot in there. Oh, that's a big ogre. I keep locking onto this guy by accident. What's over here, anyway? It's locked, okay. Are you going through there? That's not worth going down, we were just there. Oh, it's not a trap. It's not a trap. We're fine. What's in here? Fatty and short left. Oh, we were just here. Oh, that's where the ogre was. So, yeah. That door was pointless. What have we missed out on? Only the bottom floor. So I'll have to take a quick look at that after this episode and mention anything useful. Simpton Spice, Twilight Herb. Oh, crap! That. Yeah, that's scary. Scary. And he's dead? Nope. Die. He's dead, Jim. I see he's a life gem. I like to top myself off with life gems. And it's like we got the boss here because What? Why did I find him leave? No. We'll summon Louise then. Louise the sun, bro. Let's see what Louise the sun, bro, has to offer us. You may have voice chat, but we disabled it, so that's just hello the normal way. Hehehe. <laughs> Alright, let's do this. Weakness, hexes, or sorcery? Ah, oh, crap, we don't have a dragon chime in the other hand. Let's just put any old chime in the other hand. Uh, normal chime, that'll do. Right, I'll equip that. Let's do this. Guardian Dragon. Kill it. That hurts him a lot. They're fighting dragons now, baby. He's clinging on to the side. Oh crap, let's not get hit by that. You cling on to the side again. I will shoot you down with lightning. Take these lightning spears. I'll oh, stop flying you. Our mage almost has it. Our mage is doing a good job. Finish it off. Hooray. Praise the sun. Thank you very much, Louise. And also that other phantom, who I can't remember his name now, but... That's because he left before the end of the fight. Visions of overwhelming, in short, comfort. Comfort always means bonfire. Give me bonfire. Give me that bonfire. That's a big elevator. Going down. Going up. Ah, item. No. We need that item. We're going to have to go down for that. It could be a good item. Or it could be an alluring skull. I bet it's an alluring skull. Because you'd look back, see that, and then you'd be coming down for a 
and then you just realise you'd wasted like two minutes of your time. But we can always have a chat whilst we're waiting for probably getting our really crappy loot because goddamn, this is taking a long time. Or we could just like, hmm, why is this elevator so long? It's such a big tease. I just missed out an item. There's a bonfire up here first. See if there's a bonfire up here. And we'll come back for the item. I could always come back for the item later and tell you if it's any good. That's probably a better idea. Dragon Airy. Okay. That's a lot of dragons. There's a bridge. What's over here? It's Firekeeper. Hello. Bearer of the curse. Long have I awaited one such as you. One who might shatter the shackles of fate. That's me. One who can set me free. Free from what? Bear Being a firekeeper? The ancient dragon has watched over the world for eons past. That's probably one ago, isn't it? Aged feather. The dragon welcomes you. Okay. I'll say welcome to him too. Gorgeous view ahead. Uh... I can't be asked to read that sign. It's a lot of dragons. Um, what's this aged feather all about? There it is. Return to last bonfire rested at. An aged bird feather returned to last bonfire rested at can be used repeatedly. Sweet. Is it an infinite homeward bone? I wouldn't mind that. Treasure head, therefore hurrah for quagmire. Ah, oh, that's the way we're supposed to go. Okay. Treasure ahead and then for half Quagmire. Up. Oh, there's a ladder up there, isn't there? I guess we get to activate that ladder later. We can't shoot it down, can we? Nah. Okay, let's pop back to Majula for spending our souls with. Yeah, just gain some levels really. Get to level 26. Very lovely. And yeah, that'll be it for this area. And that'll be the end of this episode. Thank you all very much for watching. If you like the video, leave a like, it helps me out a lot. And subscribe if you want to see more videos similar to this one. See you next time.